I'm sorry. It came out. <laughs> you, you're <laughs> welcome to the Crack Brain Podcast. Yeah, I get one. This get is one. your host, Stefan. When have I ever talked like that? <laughs> I don't know. I was just going for it, man. <laughs> like, <laughs> I was trying to go for like a deep, sexy voice because that's what you are. Deep and deep sexy. sexy voice. So well, okay, that that's that's my new nickname. So you know, deep sexy voice. Like in in well, no, I was thinking just deep sexy. So all of a sudden, it went from like Operation Deep Throat to Operation Deep Sexy. <laughs> is that like is, is that like Deep South, but it's Deep Sexy? I don't know. I don't know. I just <laughs> crickets. Yeah. That's right. I, I don't know what that was. See, I'm I'm just gonna say that I already started the podcast before. So what you guys are now hearing, okay, was technically the start of the podcast. I'm not really, you know, welcome to episode 133 of the Crack Brain Podcast. I am your host, Stefan Watson. Sitting to my right, I have I am white deep voice, Stefan. What? <laughs> 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 judgment <laughs> judgment uh, all staring oh we're doing our fake names okay and then cool. to my right yeah <laughs> uh it's kato kato uh, voice kato. stefan kato's voice <laughs> <Stephon. laughs> hello it's kato, <laughs> kato voice stefan oh hi it's tits mcgee madam moody suck it woodpecker voice stefan Sponsored by Woodpecker Cowboy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's why I, we're separated. I know. I am in the. You know what? It's, you just needed some Superman action. It's not Battle middle. Royale so tonight. Not <laughs> sure. That's why it was. <laughs> <laughs> right. You got it? Does it does I like whoop. sitting in this spot better than whoop. over there. Yeah. It's, I, I'm now realizing that this is just not. your spot. This so, is my spot next like, to This you. is my spot. This is your spot. And then others. And then others. Yeah, others. <laughs> yeah. We're the others. Go us. You know, have you ever seen that, that movie? That the good. others? I, was good. <laughs> I legitimately do not know. I don't. I Nicole don't Kidman. Oh, it's a horror movie. So you the other, have uh, it. Yeah. Hello. And I'm not talking to you. I don't care if you're not talking to me. See, and. See, that, that, that's the thing where, where it's like okay you know that i probably haven't seen the movie you know that she has seen the movie because <laughs> um, i already assumed because i could just say something and she'd be like yeah i know what you're talking about you're an idiot peck die well <laughs> and then, they all say die in a video yet to come out it's a horror one um i talk about how during scary movies i close my eyes I'm with Stefan on this 100%. Okay, but he, but here's the thing, all right? <laughs> like, I close my eyes. You, you close, it's like, ding, ding, ding. I'm like, no. Nope. <laughs> See, you close your eyes. I don't go to the movies. So it's not just like me, <laughs> right? Because you're sitting there like, I don't want to see the scary thing, so I'm going to cover my eyes. I just don't go to where the scary thing can be seen. That's the difference. I mean, I don't go to the movies. It's mostly I try to watch it at home. Again, I don't know <laughs> to where the scary thing can be seen. I mean, I know that's worse, but <laughs> if you watch it at home, it's hiding in your closet. Yeah, you're welcome. My friends say hi. Hi. Oh, okay. No, no, I'm the thing's it. in the closet. I'm getting it. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> See, it's all connected. The amount of confused I am right now. I was too. See, this is like, but now, I say this, but she knew what I was talking about. Yeah. She's, you know, demon queen. And the demons in the closet are her friends, and her friends say hi. Those are the things in the closet. By watching it at home, you invite them in. Mm-hmm. White people stare. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <You're welcome. laughs> See, this this is the thing about trying to have a horror related discussion with. People that do know stuff about horror against someone that doesn't is I'm sitting here going like, is that a thing? What, like legitimately, you guys could go and pretty much tell me anything of like, oh yeah, see in horror movies, there's this sort of trope. And I'll go like, huh? okay, because I no, just the amount of no, like in the last episode when we were talking about <laughs> Bird Box, still have not seen the movie. I realize yeah, that I odds are it's probably not nearly as freaky as it really Spare is supposed triggering. to be like, yeah, like suspenseful and all that. I have a, like, okay, it took me at least a full year to actually watch Get Out. 
Okay, because I, I was that. sitting there going like it fits in the horror movie genre. Mm-hmm. And I sat there going like I don't need to watch this movie if it's going to freak me out. Now looking back and like there was nothing freaky about the stupid movie. It's okay. psychological. Which yeah, is it's, it's very psychological even psycho- yeah. See, no, it might be psychological for you guys. I look at it and go like that's legitimately what like is always in my brain. Okay, it's just what <laughs> what's going on with white people? <laughs> I mean, uh, what, what's well, his name? The director. What was the, the Key and Jordan Peele? Peele? Jordan Peele. I knew him from Key and Peele. <laughs> so yes! I, like, yes! Key and Peele. I could literally what's see the name? mental math going like, which one is he? If I say the wrong one, is that racist? <laughs> I mean, yeah. Anyways, no, but to see him like go from the comedy to more of that thriller has been amazing. I think that's so cool that it's just like, I'm really funny. Now I'm going to make you poop your pants. Yeah, <laughs> it's a legitimate worry for me. But yeah, I mean, it, it's I'm, that just shows depth. But like I said, it's something where I just don't go to where, th- where the scary thing can be seen. Okay, oh, so yeah, like I said, you guys are still like, way far ahead of me like the the amount of naivete that that was there in our first episode you know was just like so horror cosplay that's a thing don't kill me, <laughs> don't kill me. Thing. you were very intimidating but like thank you in a good way thank you i know like if i saw you on the street i'd probably cross but i'd also like, <laughs> like look at you like I also want to be your best friend. It's more like you know that if you're not my best friend, I will kill you in your yeah. sleep. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, no, I get that. It's the- That's exactly how it is. <laughs> I'll kill you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> got that segment right there. Ooh, that sounded strangely sexual. Sorry. <laughs> White people. That was me rewinding. <laughs> I don't know why that was completely blue. <laughs> I just look at you all and sit there and go like, you know, there there are times when I'm sitting here in this chair for like the last two years. I just let people go on with whatever they're talking about because me trying to sit there and explain what's going on or me trying to psychoanalyze what the hell what that was is just it's not nearly as entertaining as just letting you go and sludge through your own mental vomit. Well, that's what happens when you get me and Mary together. Yeah, it's called a rabbit hole. And the better one. Go on. <laughs> I was gonna say this would be a time where you would turn your back on me and join sides with her and kill, help kill me. Yes. Yeah. Well, since Carly, yeah. since uh, Carly isn't here right now, she she's she's one day away from returning, but at yes. the moment she is still in New York. <sighs> you know. <it's, laughs> this is the second time we've been apart in a year. Over oh here. my god, shut the hell up. I know. I to do that? I know. <laughs> look, it's like, I it's had the second three time. months away. I know, it's, I know, but this is like the second time. Look, I okay, I, look, I, I will say this, all right? It doesn't matter necessarily how long the person is gone. It's always maybe about like two days into it that you're like, hey, when are you coming home? Because legitimately, I, mean, like, when, I, when I feel like it home? depends on the state of the relationship and what state. She's like, in New York State. I'm you, in Utah State. Wow. Oh, dad jokes are strong today. I, look, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> What's brown and sticky, people? What's brown I, and I'm, sticky? I'm almost a decade into marriage. And anytime Tiff and I are apart for longer than, like, two days, I sit there and be like, hey, I'm done being apart right now. I need to, like, be home and our normal operating procedure, which isn't much. It's basically just like sitting down on the couch doing absolutely nothing together. Right. But it's like, it's like watching a show that mm-hmm. sharing yeah. a tray of nachos. I don't Legitimately, like nachos. Yes. Yeah, actually, <laughs> actually exactly. What That's all doing. me and Jenna do is like, what yeah. show do we want to watch? We can choose avatar Brooklyn nine, nine or an anime. Yeah. See, and it's always like the, the couple of days beforehand that you're always like jazzed, like, I'm taking a trip, I'm looking forward to this. And then you get into that, and it's just like, I'm just, see, like, even when we when we had our, our Lake Tahoe, trip, it took maybe a full day for me to sit there and go, like, Hey, I'm ready to go home. I mean, well, that was that could be a good experience, yeah, because you're, we'll you're with people from work, so yeah, I would want to go, yeah, yeah. I had fun because I was away from work. I'm glad. I was. I was, I was, I was, I was very. You guys at Lake Tahoe. What? In spirit. 
Don't remember when I took your photo and edited myself into it? Oh, yeah. No. It's <laughs> lonely. <laughs> Who's doing it on the chat? <laughs> the, 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 yeah. The one crazy chat. But biggest thing I got, got out of that trip was how trippy the motion light was. The what? Oh, the one over the, yeah, the little dresser. Like the nightstand yeah. had a, a motion detector light. Okay. So yeah. when you got out of bed, it turned on. It was freaky. Why? Why would you do that? So you can so see. You can, I was like, I mean, just I live night in darkness vision. like the rest of us. What do you, yeah, it's, if you turn on look, the light, it's going to okay. impair your night vision. We, we, we were over in the Hilton. There was a whole lot of unnecessary everything that went on just with that room where it's like, this is awesome. Why would you ever really need that? You know, it's like that having, having the, the robes. That was fun. <laughs> it's called rich people problems i know yeah. it was a thing yeah. you know and then like the platter of food that were sitting there like we don't want to touch it because we might get charged and i don't <laughs> feel like getting charged or like walk like ha- even though everything was provided by the by the old company terminix that i worked for like on check-in they're sitting like would you like your complimentary like glass of champagne and it's like Yes. <laughs> did I, I give you mine? To say no? I gave you mine, didn't I? I went to I an art store in mine? Vegas that did that. Yeah. It was a glass porcelain store that was like, here's some champagne. And I'm like, why would you give people alcohol in an art store full of glass? To make, oh, to drink yeah. and make <laughs> horrible decisions, thus buying stuff. Yeah. yeah, like that's what Nordstrom yeah. does. So when they do like their big holiday sell, um, they provide alcohol, like continuously it's just like you don't have to pay for it they just give it to you <laughs> well they check they give you a band if you know they check your yeah, id but they get people drunk so that they spend tens of thousands of dollars this one's more like just knock shit over <laughs> no, no, they, they do too but like you're yeah. looking at them all passed out on the couch and you're like uh, <sighs> the, the, the nice the commission I mean, i'm not gonna lie i've utilized that before like with anything that I want to get and Jen is like hesitant on it. I'm like, Hey, let's have a few glasses of wine. Oh, by the way, there's this purchase. I'm going to go to the bathroom. You decide if you want it or not. Oh no. Did you just say that on public? Oh, she knows. No. Okay. (laughs) I'm just like, just out yourself or no, just she, she knows. Okay. No, but it was, we had talked about it before because it was for the Xbox game pass. And I was like, it's only $1 a month right now and we can get it. It'll, you know, give games for the family to play. And I was like, after a few, I was like, I have to go to the bathroom. You decide if we get it or not. Because we were kind of like on the edge. And then I came back and she's like, you left me and I bought it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, those are the, those are the, the, the times in marriage you sit there like, I'm not going to say that that was what I was planning, but I was really hoping that was going to happen. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's marriage. Yeah. Marriage is what brings us together. If anybody knows an actor who can do that part, I need them for something. Did it? We, <laughs> we, we actually do. Because wait, who who did that over at your? Kyler did it. Yeah, Kyler. Kyler. Yo, yeah, it's like I know Kyler. Yeah, so that was at cool. my wedding. They said that. Yeah, I need mean, like the whole thing. I because we'll be in a castle for this. A, we didn't have a video. I think it was just pictures. No, yeah, it's like that part was just there was yeah. there was a lot uh, that night that there's some elements that were caught on camera and other elements that just weren't. Yeah, I was gonna so. bring that up last episode when you were talking about your backflip. Oh yeah, yeah. He that, did a backflip <laughs> and the photographer did not. Okay, catch there's it. there's many <laughs> things. Like I said, we we've been over the 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 things that have gone on over at your wedding that were wrong that all involve me like everything <laughs> that kind of went wrong with your wedding all involved me. <laughs> no no, no the, the, the food dance the food was the not food. your fault okay yes the traffic food, yes the food wasn't wasn't my fault but then like okay the the me getting put to the back of the bus uh, uh, of oh, your no, of your it walking, was so true. <laughs> I, I was at the altar, you guys. This was not me. But well, I, my wedding party puts yes. the fun to the back of the line. It's like it, it was something where it's like, okay, I forget like how oh. what order that you were doing it in, but it was like, okay, everyone would go up, you know, in singles and whatnot, and do their little dance. And the fact that like 
I was a at the end of the line and felt the need to go and point that out right before everyone was walking. So like when we're sitting there, kind of like behind the scenes, all like standing over inside the room, I sit there and go like, "Hey guys, I don't want to necessarily go and point this out to make you guys nervous, but is it weird that the black guy is at the back of the bus and everyone like I'm still meeting people for the first time during that? Yeah. Everyone goes like. <laughs> it's only Jenna and Kaden that are going like that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> well, because the way we had set up was, you know, it was uh, groomsmen, bridesmaid, groomsmen, bridesmaid, or reversed, I think. But it was how long we had known them. So first up was, um, I think Jenna's friend Katie, and then it was Kyler for me, and then someone else, someone else, someone else. Else, and I had known we had only known each other for like what a year. Yeah. If that, that. <laughs> um, so he yeah. just ended up being the last person. So it's like the last unlockable. Person. Well, okay. So it went from like, okay, I'm the last person to, it was supposed to go off with like these different cues in like in the song where it's like, yeah. you kind of walk up slowly and then all of a sudden you do a dance and it'd be over at a certain point. Well, everyone got to go and do their part of the dance. So everyone like got to do their like slow walk up and then did their dance. But then when it came to my portion where I start walking up, the cue for the dance doesn't show up in the song anymore. So it's like, I'm sitting yeah. there just walking up like, well, I guess I just don't get to dance. So I just started to just walk up. Well, cause the song was uh, something just like this by the Chainsmokers. Um, well, Coldplay featuring the Chainsmokers. Yeah. But um, so it was like the do, 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 do part that everybody danced. But his was like at that weird in between <laughs> where there was just, it's just like calm music. There's not that small segment where you dance. Yeah. And so, I mean, when it came back up, we were all on the line and kind of groovy. Yeah. It's we like we're, we're sitting there over on the line and whatnot. And then all of a sudden, I kind of look uh, I, <laughs> like we're standing there at the like at the actual line all up over there. And it's uh, right before Jenna's about to start walking up the aisle. And I kind of lean over. I'm like, guys, should I just do a backflip real quick? And all of them go, like, yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, the the photographer, whoever you had going yeah. actually doing the video, was doing a really great job of capturing everyone. All up until that point, right? You see inside the video of me going like, da -da 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 -da. and then all of a sudden, as soon as that goes on, she catches everybody else <laughs> other than me. <laughs> And, and you just see like all the dudes <laughs> sitting there looking off camera and going like, yeah, <laughs> I land and go like, ah, and then all of a sudden she pans right back. So it's just like, okay, yeah. you know, so there was oh. that. It, and then like later on during the night. So you know how like during a wedding, most people put like just married over on the back mm -hmm. and whatnot. Yeah, so during like during the reception and whatnot, me and a couple of the couple of the groomsmen, we just went outside to go and start writing like practical jokes. During and stuff like, like that. sexy dance, I want to point out. <laughs> yeah, I was so mm. we, we missed okay. the sexy dance and whatnot. So. I basically stripped for her. Yeah, he did. <laughs> I danced to Panic at the Disco's Death of a Bachelor. Oh, damn. There's a video of it on Facebook damn. if you want yeah. to watch yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, see, I'm, watch I'm it. all up on her grinding. <laughs> and like, and her dad's watching. <laughs> 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 there was supposed to, like, I remember before oh, the, man. like, before all the wedding plans, or like during the wedding plans and whatnot, yeah. there was supposed to be where all the groomsmen were yeah. going to learn to actually dance. All the It was supposed know, to be like a boy band dance yeah. at first, yeah. and all the groomsmen were involved, and it was going to be like, I was JT, and, you know, they were yeah. everyone else whose names people don't remember. But then, like, no one could meet up <laughs> yeah. for the actual choreographer yeah. dates. <laughs> so it just ended up being me, and then I, um, half of it was choreographed. Choreographed, choreographed, <laughs> choreographized. It's know. fine. It's fine. Um, do we make up words on this? Yes, we do. Words and Add things. it to the dictionary. Um, <laughs> and then the other half, I kind of just winged it. Yeah. So it's like I completely missed that, but yeah, in in the process of of missing that and writing stuff over on the car, I thought it was a good idea to bring up an inside joke from your bachelor party. <laughs> That I really shouldn't have put on the car. Bachelor party that I got a phone call, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I, her. I remember that. Yeah. Why you want to talk about that? That was a thing. Drunk. <laughs> that yeah. was fun. It's okay. I okay. Another personal story time. <laughs> I at my bachelor party, I went to the bathroom and I 
called Jenna on Messenger video chat, and I was like, hey, hon, we're having such a good time. Everything's fine. Everyone's a little drunk. Also, I'm peeing. <laughs> That's you. And I, like, aimed it down. Like, I, obviously, you don't see anything because yeah. it's tucked in the toilet. Um, but she was like, what are you doing? And I was like, oh, everything's fine. <laughs> Yeah, there's so many bad decisions. That bachelor so, party is on YouTube, by the way. It is. If you it, want to watch my bachelor party, I think we mentioned it in the last episode <laughs> too. But go watch it. Well, including the phone call that I got, or no? no okay, no. It's just like, it's so like, like, I, I edited that video sober. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So, <laughs> Stefan's eggs were in my mouth. Yep, Stefan's eggs were in your mouth. So, any else? Anyway, sorry. Um, um, but yeah, like I said, car. there, there's. <laughs> What did I put? Was it eleven inch? Yup. Yeah. Yup. I I so I made a very bad reference to a, <laughs> an eleven inch dong. Um, Deep so, dong. And well, we were playing a card game, and it was one of the cards was like eleven inch dong. Yeah. <laughs> And I put that, I think I put that like right on the passenger side. So it was directly <laughs> where everyone was going to see it. I really hadn't thought that far. So it's like, <laughs> and I'm sitting like everyone, with, all the groomsmen were sitting there like such a fun time, such a fun time. Yeah, it's going to be great. And then all of a sudden, like end of the night, you know, everyone's walking out. We're sitting there doing our goodbyes and it's right over there. That's when it kind of occurred to me like, oh, crap. This is friends and family. It might not have been a good <laughs> idea to do that. And I knew that it really was a bad idea when I saw your face because you went from like, ha ha, to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, and you no, start going like, like not saying it out loud, but you're going, or, no, no, you did say it. And you're like, really? <laughs> really? And that's, when, like, that's when all the groomsmen went from like, ha ha, to like, ha. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. And we did like a collective look at each other like too far, too far. <laughs> I don't there is also I don't know who put it, it might not have been you, but on the back someone put anal. Oh no. I don't it was either Sean or me. I, yeah, I don't. Did you guys go out with them? I think we went afterwards. Yeah, I think cuz I the, 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 it we was, wanted to we wanted to make wow. the 11 inch not feel alone. Yeah. <laughs> there was a lot of sexual references on the car. Oh, and no. we we did not take any of the paint off because we, for my wedding, me and Jenna both had a really bad cold and we were absolutely sick. Oh and no. Yeah. So we just spent the next couple of days sleeping. Like I think at the wedding, one of um, her friends were like, so what are you going to do after the ceremony? What are you going to do after the receptions? And I said, we're going home to bed. And obviously wedding night, she was like, Kaden. I'm like, no, like we are literally going home and sleeping because we're sick. I ran off to the bathroom like 12 times to get napkins to blow my nose. Six wedding sex. Yeah. Uh, Sounds uh, great. Let me tell you. uh, So much bodily Uh, fluids. Oh, not fun. But the sparklers were cool at the end. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) And see, it's like the end of sex. Sparklers with sex. Ooh, See, now I just thought I that thought boob me. tassels with, with Spark- sparklers. Exactly. Just like Woo! <laughs> I mean, that is a thing. Let's make. This I know it's a thing. It's a thing. I know it's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! So, what yeah. Are, what are we staring at? It, it, uh, Carly doesn't want to see drunk Brandon. No, but no. She like also wants to see the party. Yeah, drunk Brandon is a thing of a of the past. Yeah. So it, it'll yeah. show Still you old sober. Yes. Yeah. And I'm proud of you. Yeah. It's it, yeah, yeah. We already talked about that last episode. Well. <laughs> oh, we need to stop. I went, cold, I went cold turkey drinking. Yes. After my wonderful repainting of your bathroom. And if you want to go and rehear that story, go back yeah, to go episode check out the last episode. It's not sure if you threw up right. Right. And then I cleaned it up. So <laughs> while I was passed out on the while toilet. he was passed out. <laughs> it was an experience. It was. Right. You had to be there. You did. Well, <laughs> since was. since we do have <laughs> we do have such a fantastic guest over on the podcast. Oh yeah. You're here. It feels <laughs> only <laughs> oh, yeah. you're here. <laughs> I didn't mean that as like a bad thing. I was like, oh yeah, we should probably be talking about Moody and like her stuff now. Not like a, 
Oh, Go ahead and keep on going because explaining it is so much better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yes, it, it, it's it's been a little bit since the last time you were on the podcast, but now Thank since God. we're doing this a little bit different, <laughs> i.e., actually is the Watch live stream. Water. Yeah, what? you guys. Yeah, you guys. We're getting separated. you guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, getting you guys back inside the same arena again. I'll treat you. Even though I will say this is this is still not the infamous showdown episode. No, like no. I said, that not Freddy versus Royale. Royale. Yeah. Freddy versus Woodpecker. We'll see. Like who will survive? It's Madam, obviously. It's no longer an, <laughs> a thing about like how it. many times survive. people have been on the podcast because now technically, like you're stagnant cast on the podcast, yeah. so you're don't I mean, count. comedy isn't stagnant. You don't count. You should not be proud of that sort of joke. <laughs> I said, no, I said, I was like, I hope I'm not being stagnant on my comedy. Again, you should not be proud. <laughs> I want to be funny. That's why I'm hoping. That's why I'm still here is that people are like, you know what? That Brandon kid, he's kind of funny. What? I don't know. I'm listening to him. And I'm dealing with y'all. <laughs> the stream, and it was like the last second of me bouncing. This is the issue with you guys watching the live stream I know, at the like, same time. And if you guys want to see the live stream, like I said, so <laughs> yes, if you want to be able to see the craziness that's going on oh. as it happens. <sighs> okay, okay. If you want to see it? the live stream. Go over to our Patreon, and if you subscribe to the one dollar tier, you get the live stream. As Tyler wonderfully put it, it's only twelve dollars a year. That's the price of McDonald's. And the interrupting Stefan is quite strong. <laughs> <laughs> I just did your job for you, which everyone seems to do every <laughs> single time. Again, again, again. <laughs> At least Carly's not here. That would be a mess. <laughs> She's watching. Would you would you like to take a turn? Go ahead. Sorry. Go ahead. Yes, sir. I hate here. all of you guys right now. So yes. But yes, so like I said, as the guest being over on the new podcast, it's something where I've wanted to go and ask you so many different questions of different things that have been going on with you. <laughs> Right. So, so first, I'll just say, like, how ha how has the moody been lately? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I love yours. It's so cute. <laughs> it's so I <laughs> Are you speaking English right now? <laughs> She's speaking. Are you okay? English. She's speaking in giggle. <laughs> Here, let me just like reset I'm this just... back here real quick. Okay. There we got go. it? Okay. Good. Uh, <laughs> I just opened business a couple months ago. Madam Moody Costume Designs. Hire me, bitches. Let me say that again. Hire me, bitches. I said it wrong. Uh, I need money. Yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, same. What? Same. Everyone same. needs money. Yeah, I know. I know. But you do need well, money. I really need to give her money. <laughs> Um, let's She's see. good at her job. I'm very good at my job. Uh, actually, don't argue with me with the rates because I'm sick and tired of that bullshit. <laughs> Customer cost. See, but you me. knew that that was going to be a thing going into this. Like, Dance it's mom's driving crazy. It's yeah, it's crazy. like we had even talked about that before you had opened as far as like, I know. yeah, I just realized that, you know, people are always going to sit there and go like, oh, okay, so I need this done and this and this and this and this. Five and dollars. you're going to charge a nickel, right? <laughs> you're, funny, you're funny. You're funny. You uh, get what you pay for. So yeah. yeah. Um, also started a podcast because of Stefan. He's all like podcast go shoved me into it. Yeah. Well. I, <laughs> okay. So you, I, you had brought up the idea as far as like I kind of want to start a podcast, and I did my normal like do it, do it, do, do it. it. You need to do go it. and do this. Okay. <laughs> and then when it was just sort of like it didn't say like it didn't do anything for a long while, and then all I. I think it was was we were over at Watchtower discuss I forget what the hell we were discussing. Uh, there's I think so it was, much. I, was yeah, that it was, when I came up? I, I you guys legitimately cannot space at one point. Yeah, it's like because yeah. I think we were going and talking about 
the podcast and then you were oh yeah i have a it's like i have a website through squarespace i'm like well then you already have what you need <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah that thing that i need to pay for hire me bitch just send me yeah. money yeah um, see, yeah, <laughs> so yeah it's a uh, seam rippers and dremels podcast it's with my boyfriend fiance husband thing He's yeah. just Question a thing. Mark. He's yeah. just a thing. You're just in that weird, him. ambiguous, like, yeah, well, you're a like, thing. There we are... just... That <laughs> hunk of meat. No, hunky boyfriend. Hunky I know, boyfriend. but no, to me, he's a hunk of meat. Oh, well, you gotta tell I mean, him that, because he'll eat that up. clean and objectifying. <laughs> he likes I to be objectified it. so much. The first few episodes are a bit rocky, so you gotta bear with us, but it gets so much better. It's about... Uh, Couples in cosplays, how you met, um, if you're married, how you get cosplays to work with each other, if one's the supporter and one's the cosplayer, both cosplayers, whatever, what have you. We have quite interesting guests so far. LGBTQIA, RSTV, uh, friendly, very explicit sometimes, be warned, obviously. Right. Uh, yeah. See, yeah, see, now, <laughs> the end. Now, yeah, now, now you're going to be the, like, okay, I need to define my podcast, and then how does my podcast make sense? You know, yeah, so, eventually. Yeah, but yeah. Th those first couple episodes when you think you know what you're doing, like all the planning that goes into like, okay, it's going to go this way and this way and this way, and it, it's going to be perfect, but I, I'm going to leave room for error, and then it doesn't go at all the way that you think it does. Well, I know what I was doing. Josh did not. <laughs> I'm like, people like our banter. And then one episode, it was like every other sentence was flirty with me. And it's like, nobody wants to hear that. Okay. I'm sorry. It's like, I'm you're mean. hot. Okay. We talk about cosplay. Ooh, you're hot. Okay. Well, nobody cares. I mean, hot. Come on. At the same time, though, can you blame him? Because oh, where's your super? He's hot. <laughs> well, no, I'm just I'm just saying, like, if I was to do a podcast with Jenna, I obviously would be like. Show me your boobies. I love you, and you are amazing, and, like, <laughs> damn. See, <laughs> and, and I, I don't know if I could join you in there, because Tiff and I have done, it. they haven't come out, but, like, after doing episodes of the podcast, I would leave the, the, uh, the, the microphones on, and sometimes I would do, like, little mini episodes with my kids just to be like, oh, I think this would be kind of fun to go and do. And then yeah. I did some episodes with Tiff. They were never like, oh, my God, you're hot. It was usually just like Tiff sitting in front of the microphone like, what do I say? <laughs> and like, oh, let's talk about this. Great. What do I say? That's anytime I play video games with Jenna, she's like, how do I do this? Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Yes. Mini episodes Mondays, moods Mondays. It's mental illness with cosplay, how to deal with it. Right. Yeah. And that's yeah. That, like that's yeah. one of the things where I love seeing how you've how you've like really progressed in your idea. Because I remember when it was like, okay, I'm gonna do the podcast, but then what else do I do? And I remember <laughs> like, okay, well maybe you could try this and then try that, and then you start doing that, but then also start doing a lot of other stuff. Too. I was like. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I want to do it? Right. See, and that's like... <laughs> Translation. I, I have too much to, on my plate. Give I me money, talk bitches. to toddlers. <laughs> it's so much fun talking to toddlers. They're the best. Actually, my youngest, Kaisa, when he, I used to babysit him, because before me and my wife were married, I was the nanny. I know, porno, right? Anyways. Is she singing the nanny? <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Geisen used to come up with like weird languages. Like he'd be like, Shlip not be it's like it at the Muda is a bit and I'd be like, uh-huh. Fucking okay. Shouldn't I be it's a good and so don't know that's true. And he'd be like, Okay. <laughs> he'd be like, Well played, sir. I talk to my dog like that. <laughs> Sweet. 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 And they look at you and you're like, you're fucking weird. And then go back to sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Or she'll just be like, I have to pee. Like, can you just suit up, woman? Let's go. Every morning. Right. Every morning. Right. I'm like, I'm in my pajamas. I don't want to go outside. And it's like, okay. Hmm. Scratch on the door. I'm like, I don't want to fucking go outside. Mine goes, ah, 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 
She's that's kind of what Carly is when she wants to be a kid. <laughs> Damn, dude, she's watching. <laughs> what do you she, do? When she wants food, she's like, <laughs> Don't force me. Don't force me. I've lived this oh. long. Speaking whatever. She wants to continue living. Stop God. testing that. Oh, stop doing that. She won't kill me. You know that I'm like, I'm right there. And she's just like, hold. She won't kill me. She, no, she said, hold, honey. Just hold. And just at any minute now, she's going to be like, go. Get him. She's going no. to see if she says anything. No, what was it? She's she's the, uh, uh, what the dog, your dog in my D&D campaign. Carly <laughs> controls it. Honey, <laughs> honey, yeah, the uh, what a is honey? she? Massive, Mastodon? The Mastiff. Mastiff. He owns a Mastiff in my. Oh, yeah, he owns a Mastiff in my D and D campaign called Honey. It's bigger and than I the am. The first, it's like his companion, and the first like instant Carly shows up. Carly like rules like a natural 20 animal handling and like makes honey go attack him it and takes the, me off it's the best thing ever who's a good dog who's a good dog oh you are oh you're so cute oh my it's god get him yeah that's, that's how pretty, you do it that's pretty much it yeah she, she hasn't said anything yet i know yeah being a keyword but she's also in new york she's in new york right? yeah. dude she's, she's in the future she already knows what have happened. you have you been to new york I mean, no. hello. Yes. I have not. I want to, though. I need to go back east. It looks beautiful. It's, you it, stand it's, in one spot and you're entertained for hours. You're not wrong. <laughs> let's, the, the one and only time I've been to New York, I had fun and then didn't have fun. And then I stupidly walked onto a movie set while me and my buddy <gasps> were walking over onto a movie set, which you can't quite see us in the actual shot. Oh, no. I'm, um, oh God, uh, Stumper Dumper, uh, no, it, it's, it's with Ashton Kutcher. I no, seriously it. can't remember Brittany Friends Murphy? With Benefits, Brittany. The Guardian. No, oh, no, that's no, so no. Just, just married. married. So the, I, I remember the scene. It's where he's on his phone and he starts running after a cat. Um, because that literally could be any rom-com <laughs> ever. Oh, like, God. come on. Maybe it's just married. Is it with Brittany Murphy? Was she not there? No, I think it was with Cameron Diaz. Cameron. Diaz. God dang it! I or think it, Catherine Heigl. I seriously can't remember. I seriously can't remember. I don't but like it, you right it, it's, now. It, it's something where, like, <laughs> the uh, the the like I remember it was me and my buddy Paul. We're we're walking down the street and we're in suits because we were doing kind of like a religious thing at the same time. And we're sitting there chatting back and forth. <laughs> And it's like, we're just sitting there walking and all of a sudden we turn a corner and we see Ashton Kutcher in the middle of the street. And it's like, we couldn't see anything else because we yeah. were still kind of like partway through the corner. And we're like, dude, is that Ashton Kutcher? And we just start seeing him book it. We're just like, Duh. <laughs> <laughs> So all of a sudden, like, we start like, that's when we actually start turning the corner. And that's when we see cameras and people and everything. Production. And we see all the cameras directed over at us. And all of a sudden, like, we go like, eh, oh. We're so back, it up. back it up. Back it up. We're sitting there like, oh, okay, well, that, that's a thing. So all of a sudden, like, we were, it's like we're still kind of right around the corner. Well, all of a sudden, like, we hear, cut, go. And we're like, okay, well, maybe that's something else. And all of a sudden, like, the casting director starts running over around the corner and comes up and it's like, okay, you guys were in the shot. So technically, we need you to sign a waiver. Oh, no. So all of a sudden, we're like, Okay. Oh god. So we sign the waiver of just like, like a release of being able to use our images over in there. And then when the movie came out later, God, I want to remember when something in Vegas. What was, happened in what Vegas? Happens in Vegas. With yeah. Cameron Diaz? Yeah, that's the movie. Okay. That's oh, yeah. awesome. Okay, so it's the scene over in New York. I, swear, I I need to go and find find that. But yeah, it's like it's when all of a sudden he starts toward I think it's like towards the end of the movie, but he starts booking off for, for that. We spent forever trying to like actually figure out if we were actually in the, oh, like in the movie and whatnot. Because what sometimes happens is even if you're an extra and you're in a shot, but you're mistakenly in a shot, you can still get paid for it. We actually got checks That's for being awesome. inside the movie, even $10. though we weren't in the movie. Okay. <laughs> it's like because we had sat there going, like, I think 
I think you can see like our arms, or I think you can go and do that. Because like, they only did that one little mistaken shot. But like for the rest of the day, they didn't shoot anymore. So they must have got other shots before then or did a really good shot, really good job of editing because you can still see the corner. So yeah. Did you, well, did you like on the waiver, did you have to put like your address? Yeah, it's like yeah. you have to put your you address put and contact information, your, your name. It's like you have to put everything down. I, I mean, I don't okay. know these things. I yeah. just, I just, English. so it, it was something where it's like we dumb, stupidly walked onto a set over in new york and i was like that was a thing but then like still had a pretty decent trip all the rest of the time where it's like new york is fantastic for like have really comfortable shoes because you will walk everywhere <laughs> getting a cab fun. in new york is a expensive and b just stupid okay you can find anything and much like utah they have kind of like a similar grid system where it's like i need to find what's on fifth and 42nd street Guess what? Just go in the grid order and you can find whatever street you're looking so for. Nice. You know, mm -hmm. so it yeah. it was a Shout really good trip. System. Yeah, it's like, and then people, we had that same kind of like, oh, people over in New York, they must be like obnoxious and kind of mean. Freaking Grand Central Station, we walked up to a dude that we thought was going to like kill us. It was the nicest dude in the world. And Wait, we were just like, why did you walk up to a dude you thought was going to kill you? Because we needed to know where the hell we were okay. supposed to go. Like, we, we also got <laughs> yeah, I just turned had to around that. at first. Like, <laughs> it's like, oh. that guy's going to kill us. Let's go talk to him. I mean, at that point, That's how I kind of just standing it. around and just sort of like doing this. I'm just like, I need to find, I, I need to talk to somebody, and he's the only one there. And he's like, why not? Whatever. So just me walking yeah. up over to him. Yeah, it was a thing. But, yeah, it's like, it, will, will I ever go back to New York? Probably, but will it be something that I want to do? Eh, never. Would I ever want to, like, New York is a great place to go once just to be able to do, and then multiple times if you actually have a reason to go back. Yeah. Yay. Me. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. You have a reason <laughs> to go back. I have very well, much reasons to go. Going Tell back me. to the whole, like, looks like they're going to kill you, but is the nicest people ever. I used to... Um, go to AA meetings and it's always like the typical leather jacket, chains, beards, tattoos, badass looking guys. First going there, I was like, these people are scary. <laughs> but then I got talking to them and they're like the nicest people ever. They're like, yeah, I helped this old lady cross the street. I helped this <laughs> mom with her kids trying to take the groceries in. And I'm like, oh, honey, you're so great. They got your back. Yeah. Like yeah, if I'm, nice. if anybody tried to mess with you, I'm pretty sure they'd be like, "You go I down." Know. Yeah, they're great. That was, that was a good part about that. Uh oh. Uh oh, what? No, what no we do? it was nice. Me it was nice. Yes, it was nice. There you go. So, yeah. The thing that means to kill me. Probably. <laughs> well, is this a movie or are we filming? I don't, something? I don't know. I don't know. I'm like, what? What are we at? What are we filming? <laughs> Nothing. The death as, of as, Brandon. <laughs> if we're shooting the death of Brandon, it should be from this perspective, Genius. I can't. I'm stuck. Oh. Us filming you. And not in a kinky way. Brandon yeah. Peck dies at the end. <laughs> How many times I've had to put on crack brain stuff, this is not a porno. <laughs> Hashtag butt stuff. <laughs> yeah, that was a thing for a, Wait a, second. a while. I what was the hashtag again. blue arrow? Blue arrow eight? <laughs> blue arrow eight. Hey, I yeah, can't talk. I can speak. Hate. Can you English for me today? Yeah. Uh, I don't know what you're saying, so I don't know. <laughs> okay, never mind. Yeah. I don't know the hashtag. What's the hashtag? The 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 amount. Early well, days. Yeah, it, it was. Well, okay, yeah. There's been hashtag blue arrow hate. There's been hashtag we are member. Uh, <laughs> I, I know that we hashtag are hashtag butt stuff. <laughs> hashtag <laughs> team Lunchy. same voice before like there was team same voice for me and Izzy Keener, and then there's hashtag team same name for me and Stefan from from Vegas. So there, there's so many hashtags. You're welcome. Left cheek. hashtag yeah yeah cheek. Yeah, no, left, left cheek. Left yeah, cheek. left cheek. Oh, Not a porn. Yeah. I remember that one. That's, that's, that's so, that was great. <laughs> so many, so many things. <laughs> right. So, oh, yes. Oh, it's sponsored by. Sponsored by. Madam Media Cosplay. Yeah, that. 
that. <laughs> that. Yeah, that was great. It, like I said, it, I'm what? hitting this leg on the table, and I keep thinking I'm playing footsies with the people <laughs> next to me, and I'm like, I did it with Ray, and I'm like, oh my god, I'm so sorry, and then I just did it with you, and I'm like, that's not me. I know it's not you. I have tiny baby feet. Mm -hmm. Legitimately, have no idea what's going on. Anymore. It's okay. It's Stop okay. playing footsie with people. <sighs> sorry, Jenna. <laughs> <laughs> She wants a plate. Never mind. <laughs> I'll stop it right there. Stop. Yeah. Uh, so okay now. <laughs> since we actually, next segment. I love you guys. I swear to God, I, I love you guys. <laughs> Maybe. All right. Since we actually have kind of like a, a a good panel of cosplayers and you know beginner cosplayer <laughs> okay, i have not cosplayed anything in my life actually no that's no, a lie, no, that's that's a lie. lie. okay that's because lie. you did show up over at thanksgiving point being uh wolverine wolverine, wolverine. I, will count I also that did favorite. hagrid at was there any game? Yep. oh that was, that so was hagrid. good hagrid yeah no. i liked that one yeah, so i was just drawn I know. That I took do you like still that. have it i do i do still have that oh, i have all the all the things i need to get in shape so i can do a better wolverine See the amount of things that we like, I because I even have a conversation with him. Like, hey, me and him have to get in better shape because of a, a production that we're planning. Yeah, like, <laughs> quite workout, Brandon. <laughs> I remember that he came up and he was like, "Just fix all of this," and I was like, "Damn!" <laughs> like, I'm already in pretty good shape. I'm sorry. I mean, I was like, "You cute," but you need to get. Your arms. <laughs> Brown is a shape. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it, it, so it, like I said, there, there, there's something being planned, which, you know, you know, the, like the full scope of and whatnot. And I've continued to sit there and, and work out even more on. I haven't worked out yet. Yeah, I know. My I know. job's a workout. Yeah, but then there's... I'm not. De I'm not doing the definition. Yeah. It's like, see, and that's the thing where it's like, because even like for me personally, I'm, have to go and work out for an actual so so i promised a friend that i would do a 300 shoot mm. okay stop looking at me <laughs> i mean i don't mean to objectify so, you but yeah it's I'm like so you know the last three weeks has actually been me starting to step up my workout and yeah there's that so and me getting to sit here and tell you like hey so i've got this thing planned that's not a 300 shoot I need you to go and start working out. They don't want me in a 300 shoot. Just plain and simple. I didn't say it. <laughs> I'll do one. I think we can just shave abs into my hair on my belly. <laughs> I'd be like, hey. Airbrush is a wonderful thing. I do Makeup not. is amazing. You know what sucks, though? I have to get EKGs pretty regularly. But regular. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't say my R's because half my tongue's out of my mouth. But anyways, uh, um, I have to get EKGs pretty often, um, and they have to shave. Uh -huh. And I get like shave spots on my legs, shave spots on my chest, and I show home. I come home, and I just have two shave spots right here, and Jenna's just like, eh. <laughs> and I'm like, throw back to the waxing video. I <laughs> See, even then, like, I don't even feel for you with that because I had three and a half years of shaving my legs and my junk for dive. Okay. Dive, because dive, dive. it's like, okay. Shaving, like, yeah. It's like shaving the legs was more like, okay, whatever. Just want to go and look good. But shaving, like, my actual crotch was more or less just like, okay, trying to deal with a Speedo. When you're in high velocity rotations and whatnot, sometimes if you don't have things just right, little things can kind of make a little appearance. So actually having skin on Speedo actually helps to kind of like keep it inside. I'm sure it's a little thing. It's 18 inches. <laughs> I'm just imagining you doing a girl thing where you're like this. Shaving. <laughs> so <laughs> that okay. is what girls look like. We look like, you know, we're like. See, and and that's why, like, I okay. Well, I mean, so like, I I can sit there and like flip, like flip them there. Okay, get that, and then it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I flip it real quick. <laughs> 
For those who aren't watching the video, exactly he just like had his hand out by his shoulder. <laughs> like, is it a bazooka? <laughs> what are you packing down there, man? <laughs> this is so what I wanted to happen. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't even like you did that subconsciously too. Like this is this practice. is why I can't have a conversation sometimes with you. Guys. Your dick gets in the way. <laughs> I'm trying to look at your face. I'm looking at the other head because oh. it's on your shoulder. <laughs> Talk about the elephant oh. in the room. Sorry, Jeff. <laughs> the elephant trunk, you mean? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my, <God. laughs> my cheeks hurt. <laughs> and not my butt cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, stop smiling. So, <laughs> so you're shaving your testicles with a, a razor. You okay? You good? Okay. You're good. You're good. <laughs> How do I go on with the story? Because <laughs> now I can't stop thinking about like <laughs> what hand gestures do I that are modest? <laughs> At least I didn't do the whole yes. thing. <laughs> I'm, it's okay, okay, anyway, so, oh, so, no. so, so, yeah, it's like, so flip up and then shave. And what, I'm not doing anything for, I'm going to have one arm behind <laughs> the back. Okay. You're still flipping up with this hand. <laughs> that, you have to shave. <laughs> I think, I don't think you're going to win this one. This is, you shave like this? No, it's a, what you do it with the with the the straight razor with the leather and the barbers go. I don't use that on the side of my junk, sitting there like it's made of Teflon steel too. I know straight razors scare me though. They're fun. I got one and it was the worst shave I've ever had. It's because you didn't do it right. The, I didn't do it. The professional did it. He cut me. Like first slice, and then he was like all scared the rest of the time. Then they, then they didn't do it right because I've had a straight razor shave and it is magical. Mm -hmm. I've also had a straight razor shave and it was scary, <laughs> but it was smooth. Well, yeah, my your face right now. My yeah. my father in law kind of gets me because we were talking. I was talking about trimming my beard, and my mother in law was like. <laughs> Why don't you just have Jenna do it if all the barbers mess up? And I, I was like, well, some days I don't want her near there. And father-in-law immediately comes in and is like, because you don't want your wife to have a razor near your throat some days? I'm like, yup. Yeah. <laughs> oh, trust me. It's, I, I, it's I, just how it is. Yeah. It's, it's how it is. You yeah. Know it. Like I said, it's like I trust Tiff with the utmost 97% trust. <laughs> Yeah, like, except yeah. for when it comes with that, and it deals very little with like, oh my god, she's gonna get mad at me and cut. No, it, it has more along the fact of like we have what we call purple butterfly moments. So it's times when like you're doing <laughs> one thing and then all of a sudden you become immediately distracted oh, and okay. enthralled with something else going on. I don't want her to have one of those moments while oh, she's that. while she's cutting my junk because it's happened. Oh, where, like Todd. I used to go and do a thing where I would have these parties. Where I'd sit there and be like, hey, I need to go and have people <laughs> shut up. Parties. You know what that makes it sound like, right? We like, all thought of the same thing. Is that a party? Is that what that is? I just learned the what that was. Party. Party. What's a Tupperware party? Oh. You make it burp. You make it burp? You make it burp when you shut it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, continue. You have parties. Balls. Party. Balls. What? I, I'm, I'm going to just put this oh. out. Yeah. When you said like you making it burp off of Tupperware and whatnot. I don't know why, but I just had queefing in my <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking Aladdin. <laughs> like the beginning part of Aladdin where he makes the Tupperware burp. Ah, like, oh, yeah, I still I, I'm still, yeah, I'm still good. <laughs> anyway. That's where I went. You turned it into something else after no. I turned the first thing into something else. No. You're welcome. <laughs> Okay, but you're having a party where yeah, you're so I'm shaving your testicles. No, 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 no. They're not shaving testicles. But I used to <laughs> yeah. have cut, like cut my hair parties where it's like I have to go and cut my hair, and I realize <laughs> that with my hair, it's like an etch a sketch. You can't really mess up. So uh, people would come over and be like, "Yeah, you can go and like style whatever you want inside my hair." So sometimes people would like. Usually, their first go to is like, "I'm gonna write my name in their hair," and ha, ah, that's a cool thing. I'm like, "Yeah, have fun with it. I don't really care," you know. But I just give everyone kind of like a plot of land. And what? <laughs> so, it's the earth. It's yeah. Like, 
the amount of times when like it would become Tiff's turn and, and Tiff would be like, okay, I'm going to try doing this. And what was that? And going, and it's like, and, oh. You went on someone else's well, side of land. There, it's like, you were supposed to have like this and you got this. And fine, reverse Mr. T. Yeah, that's usually what it would wind up being. So, no, that would be Friar T. Okay. I'm thinking uh, Zoolander. <laughs> Zoolander. Yeah, right. Yeah. Like yeah. the yeah. little fairy. You got to. <laughs> yes, thank you. Yeah. That's so, yeah, it's like, I just don't want her to have one of those moments on my testicles. Okay. So, <laughs> yeah. are they Greek? My testicles. <laughs> it sounds like a god. Where's your, where's your weak spot? <laughs> My, 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 my where's your, I don't know why I'm doing like an old English accent, mainly because I'm American. But anyway, where's your weakness? My testicles. Where's testicles? <laughs> Underneath my 18 inch. In my groinal area. <laughs> so. Groinal, oh. Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. Hercules, Hercules testicles. Yes, please. See, I know. <laughs> Why I why I thought of okay. So as someone on this table that also listens to to Geek Show, yes, Testicles came out of a conversation with Shannon because do you remember what he would call Spart the show Spartacus? No, was boner it? fight? Yes. <laughs> okay. So I remember having oh my God. a conversation that was with so him long ago. <laughs> over at uh, God, it was over at one of the movie nights, oh. um, over at Brewies, and we're sitting there over at the bar, and I can't, I can't really remember what we were talking about, but it started going into Spartacus and whatnot, and I'm just sitting there half drunk, and be like, okay, and. Uh, what what's the sh- what's what's Spotify? Uh, Spot as was it? Testicles. <laughs> and he's sitting there like what? And I'm like <laughs> Testicles, Spotify. <bonafide."> okay, <laughs> like, honestly though, you drunk is pretty fun. I haven't been drunk in a long while, so it's because I very like I get tipsy. It's like I get different levels. I get like feel good. I get tipsy. I get feel real good, and then I get hey. <laughs> Test, please. How are you doing? Yeah. So at my bachelor party. What? I'd rather, I'd rather have a bachelor party than bachelorette. Yeah. Sorry. Well, yeah. I mean, that's just how life is in general. It's better to be a man, unfortunately. I didn't say that. <laughs> I, didn't I was just going to say, I want to go paintballing for my bachelor party. No, I'm <laughs> not going paintballing. Last time I was paint, I went paintball. I got paintballed in the throat. Oh, <laughs> I got God. it in the mouth. That's what she said. I did say that. I know it was so bad. Do you not know? Uh, yeah, fat lip and everything. It was like, well, bam. I'm not. I'm not gonna be mature. And then I got splattered everywhere. Then you're making Jesus. it so hard. Well, it's. But um, cha. Do you feel proud of anything you just said? No. The stupidity has moved to the right. I feel pretty. I, no, this is almost gone. That's why. Oh, you're so pretty. What that is that? It's a weird sour oh, green got... apple. Yeah, there's the rock star drink. You want to try it? I just was like, I thought I saw a nipple. The rock star. Give this me one, the subtly this, racist rock star. What does that say? Puberty? What is this? Watermelon. <laughs> what does it say? It says pure, pure zero. zero. Yeah. I was so almost right. I mean, <laughs> pure zero to puberty. Yeah. Zero to hero. <laughs> Kill it! Full circle! Yes! It's all connected. I hate that that is your stupid little tagline. She's helping fill in the blanks. I'm happy. <laughs> Wait. What? We're on a team? No, you're just helping me. I don't want you on my team. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Show the camera. Team. Show the camera your face. <laughs> Sorry. That was, face. That's baby lemon face right there. When you give lemons to babies, that was baby lemon face. That was. I mean, lemon. I don't know if it's that bad, but it is pretty bad. You want to taste? It's worse than the apple. It is. Take it, pass it down. It's not cocaine! <laughs> it's not <laughs> cocaine! You don't want to see me what I look like on sugar. It's zero sugar. 
Remember zero to hero? Yeah, zero sugar, zero calorie, zero B vitamins. Um, I'm a chick. We're supposed to live off of zero calorie. I'm no, a dude don't and I don't salad. live off like uh, I live salad. off of Salad. 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 Salami. It's like a burger minus the burger. 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 I would Who's like from again? a damn burger. That's it's Steve Pink, Panther. Pink Panther. Pink Panther. You want it back? Oh. Chug. So chug, much. Chug, chug, no. chug, chug, drink, drink, drink. I mean, drink. do you want to give me more caffeine, Uncle? It's, <laughs> see, this is my issue when it comes to anything watermelon is because it never tastes like oh, watermelon. God. It just What does watermelon, watermelon, watermelon taste like, though? Watermelon tastes like watermelon. Okay. I mean, watermelon, is, is, watermelon, fire watermelon is like celery. It's a very, <laughs> it's a very distinguished flavor, but it's very. No, like, celery's got zero nutrients in it. Well, you, but it has a taste. I'm not talking about the nutrients. Peanut butter. I thought she was gonna say penis. <laughs> celery and penis. I was you know, trying just to be nice. Thursday night snack. Put whipped cream on both. On celery. Just don't don't just acknowledge don't. him. Just don't. I am Cream. vexed <laughs> by everything going God, on right now. Well, yeah. now yeah. you're just saying white things. <laughs> it was a time we were having dinner. My niece was across the table, and I put you know whipped cream on my celery just because I wanted a little treat. And she's like, she wanted some, so she held out a celery stick, and I had a ready whip thing, and I sprayed it, and it went down the length of the celery all over her face. Oh, why, so why she, would you tell that tell story? <laughs> so she won't take, she won't let me give her any ready, ready, Whoa, ready, what? Ready, <laughs> any ready way. Ready, ooh, you, that you like were on thin ice right there. You almost <laughs> said something different and that was almost really bad. And everyone was a feminist. <laughs> She's a very innocent girl. That didn't make let's it any not, better. <laughs> so, um, Ever seen Bandersnatch? Well, no. Oh, that's the that's the new uh, American Horror Story. No, no that's no. the new. It's the Black, Black Mirror. Black yeah. Mirror. Yeah. yeah. So it's the own, no, it's basically the not. choose your own adventure. Yeah. No, yeah, I had about it. I haven't yeah. seen it either. Fuck that show. They did that on a uh, Final Destination three, like the deluxe edition. You could choose a, choose a path. Probably not as smooth. Mm. Yeah, but, yeah, but like it wasn't quite as extensive as those choose your own adventure books. I, I love those. that. My favorite Choose those. Your Own Adventure book was um, Goosebumps. Uh, Goosebumps. Star no. Wars. Stop agreeing. Something, sure. something, Obi Wan Kenobi. And it was a Choose Your Own Obi Wan Kenobi. Did you, um, was he on the high ground? He's always on the high ground. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know. Yeah. We've I lost the so fun. <laughs> He's know, gone. He's shaking his head at me. The stupid has transversed back to the left. Is on top of me. You're Hello welcome. there. <laughs> Hello there. Hello there. <laughs> Hello there. Okay, Ewan McGregor, be Obi Wan Kenobi again, please. Ew, he'll you do mean it. Jesus? Yes, be Jesus. Be my Star Wars Jesus, <laughs> please. <laughs> I saw a picture of it was Ewan McGregor as Obi Wan Kenobi, and then Jar Jar Binks next to him, and it was like Satan talking to Jesus, oh, trying to manipulate Jar Jar. And I was like, "This is hilarious." Oh, what is happening? You saw only long time. <laughs> what, is, what? What? I sit there <laughs> trying to figure out how I can like join said conversation. And I just sit here and go like, no, nope, that wasn't it. It's basically like waiting for double dutch of like, when when am I going to get in? When am I going to get in? And you just sit there. And it just after a while, you sit there. Be, you're being confused by like the people spinning the rope. Because you're going like, I'm not even going to. No, that's just, no, it's not my time. It's not my time. The last like five minutes, I just sat there the entire time being shocked by what you guys were going. Going like, I don't want to go in. Something. No, no, this is just, just bad for me. No. No, so yeah. You know who else was shocked? Sure, go ahead. <laughs> Mace Windu at the end of episode three. You know, are you proud of me? <laughs> I am. That one is good. I'll I'll take that one. What? I am the Senate. And there's treason then. Crickets. 
Yeah, because it's like where where do you go from there? There's there's no good transition into any realm of conversation from, the, and you guys just look at me, go like, yes, monkey dance. <laughs> no one called you monkey. I knew someone was going to take it, Rachel. <laughs> okay, well, you looked directly at me as if I'm always the one who does. <laughs> at her, at her, I don't know. She's like. Look at not to. You went like Why dog whistle octave. <laughs> Why do people always feel the need to con like make a comment when I actually do? The you realize that's a thing that people do is when they get shocked by things, they just go up an octave. It's because your voice is I one did of that the to best, everybody though. One of your best features. And so that's what gets pointed out. When people think Stefan, they think Stefan's voice because A podcast and B, your voice is just amazing. But see, like, okay, it, it's, I either get the, like, oh, it's, it, it's the deep voice, Stefan, or the regular voice, Stefan, or then it's the Chris Tucker, like, what you doing, man, type voice, Stefan. <laughs> I said dog whistle, so at least I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Huh? That was actually a pretty good whistle. I was surprised that it turned out like that. <laughs> so, there we, well, uh, okay, so. Should we talk to people? What are we doing? What's happening? No. <laughs> what are we're we doing? coming to a close. Okay. <laughs> okay. Came, oh, came at the beginning. We made it. Because, yes. So, yeah, cool. that, that's a whole thing. So, we did it. We, we, like I said, and I, I want to say thank you for, for coming over on the podcast. Which How can people find the pod, find your podcast, find oh, me. You know, oh, you and everything like that. What platforms? Uh, Facebook for Meta Moody Costume Designs. Hire me, bitches. I need money. That's no, not all podcast? the same URL. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> it's not. It's not. It's just Meta Moody Costume Designs on Facebook. Uh, Meta Moody Cosplay on Instagram, which is more just towards my cosplay. And on iTunes, Stitcher, Google Play is Seam Rippers and Dremels. That's it. I think I'm done. Yeah. I'm, nice. I'm good. That, that that's that's pretty good. Nice. Yeah, and yeah. like I said, tune in over on Mondays over on Nerd Channel. Okay. Oh, the many episodes. Sorry, yeah, I was still episodes. planning things, guys. <laughs> yeah, Welcome the many sub Mondays for mental illness. What? Welcome to running your own business. Ah! Yeah. You only sounded like SpongeBob for a second. Ah! I can't do it. Uh, <laughs> I, can't. I can't either. I can do dolphin. Ah! Not gonna try. I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> <laughs> At least she's not my dog and sounds like a tauntaun. <laughs> so yeah, I, I don't. Thank you for listening to this episode <laughs> of the Crackburn Podcast. Okay, if you want to be able to actually watch what's going on over here, you can join in to our it's like to our Patreon. One dollar gets you access to the podcast and a few other features, as well as if you go on for the five dollar, the five dollar and up, you start getting physical reward. Oh. Physical rewards sound so jacked up. But yes, you can start getting things like our our <laughs> stickers that just have come in. You will be getting at least one of those a month, uh, as well as the different prints that we will be doing, and so much more in advance. <laughs> so hand motions. <laughs> Oh, I yelled that directly to the mic. Sorry, audience. That's a thing. So, yes, until next time, people, we thank you for listening, and we will talk to you all later. Bye. 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 Have your faces.